Okay guys, we're gonna work next on the seat tube, okay? So you've got it written there. And, and that's gonna fit in here. We're gonna start first with this measurement here, which is 40 millimeters. So take out your steel ruler, your pencil, your electrical tape. So I'm gonna again, just nicely mark 40 mil all the way around, okay? Take your electrical tape, again, just follow through. The beauty of this build is that it is a repeat process. So once you've done one, you've done them all. Obviously you've got slightly different measurements and different tubing diameters. And the more, the neater you work, the better the bike's gonna look at the end, okay? Again, take your Stanley knife, good old trusty, and just peel back that top layer. Super quick, super easy. Okay, if you peel potatoes, you can build this bike. That's how simple it is. Okay, just peeling back, testing the fit. Oh, and that's getting close. Just gonna take my file, following the tape, and just with the edge of the file. Okay, so that's now fitting really, really nicely. So I'm happy with that. So I'm gonna now move on to this final section. Just remove the seat tube back out. And we're going to measure 50 mil as on the drawing. Okay, so 50 here. Again, I'm going to make lots of little marks so it's super neat. And that I can get a really nice edge and a really good fit. Okay. Again, I'm going to take my electrical tape. Okay. And I'm just going to run the electric tape and just follow each of my lines. Again, just pop a bit of masking tape and that's going to keep everything neat while you work. Okay. Pick up the old Stanley knife. From the edge of the tape, just peel back just with the sanding paper. I can even use this edge of the file just to take in the wall. I'm going to check the fit again. Okay. Okay, guys, next step is to select your down tube, which is the final tube of the front triangle. And I'm going to start again, taking the measurement from the drawing, 40 mil here. I've made a mark using my steel ruler. Take your electrical tape, and I'm going to take my masking tape again and just protect the bamboo where I'm working. I'm going to select the Stanley knife, just with the sandpaper, checking the fit, and then just fitting that all together, like so. Okay. So what I've done here is I've done a rough fit. So that's everything roughly fitting together. I can see there's little bits I need to tweak, but I'm pretty happy with how that's fitting together. And what I'm going to do is just work some of these small bits that still need a bit better fit. And that's going to be my dry layout. So I'm not going to put any glue on yet. I'm just going to make sure that everything's fitting together before I do any more. Thanks for watching this short tutorial. For more information on bamboo bikes, builds and components, visit our website. And for more general updates, Follow us on social media and if you like what you see, subscribe to our channel.